Okay, floor is done. And I just got to move. Just stuck back. I totally forgot to go. Oh, fuck, I gotta go to the Joseph. Yeah, you do. <laughs> you were supposed to be done between 9 and 10. I'm gonna put back my Rosanna on. I'm gonna put the news on. Fuck that, I got 45 of these fucking things. I'm getting rid of them. Well, 42. Alright, I'm gonna move the table back. Oh shit. <laughs> Call them and make sure you can still go. Oh shit. I'm going with you. That does not happen. Why? Why are you limping? Fucking knee hurts. Hurts like a little fucking. I swollen? I don't know. Does it look like that? You like that right, Chicken Little? What's the back of the knee? Yeah. I think he bumped in the middle of the night or something. Uh, if it's at the back, you might have pulled a muscle. Eh, could be. Why is this crooked? Alright, I need broom. I need to put this back. Are you recording? Yes. No, but I got somebody making a mistake on tape so I can actually be right about something. Do you know how hard it is to be right about something? Yeah, around this house. <laughs> and around other people, I agree with that. Thank you. Yeah, there's something right here I have to get up. No, that's the floor. <laughs> this floor is just so shitty, it's not funny. <laughs> what? Say it out loud! I said, but you said you had to get something up. Yeah, I thought you it was shit. To, you went down to scrubbing and everything, and then you was like, damn, it's the floor. Yeah. <laughs> that happens to me a lot. I gotta move the camera so I'm gonna be able to shut it up if they mop. Alright. Oh, 
sit down. Damn. She don't know how to listen. Don't, don't scratch me. Alright, I'm going for this floor to dry. I did the dishes, now I'm going to do the counter. This toothpaste thing I got cleaned. So he couldn't brush his teeth. Uh -huh. So he had a fit. Where's Jack's toothbrush? Right there. Where? Oh, I see it now. Thank you, though. I got a new scrub, Daddy. But I still have the old one for just cleaning up, like, nasty shit. Throwing this away. That needs to be cleaned. This whole thing needs to be cleaned. Get off here. The hair gets everywhere. My hair does. Yeah. It's like cat hair shedding. slip when I'm cutting. That's the bad part about it. This serves a purpose though. Yeah. falling apart. Goodbye all you people in having fun land. Yeah. She's funny. See you later. Okay. This damn thing's falling apart. I might have to retire this, but I like this thing. You know? Um... So yeah, back to the story I was telling you about the fire and stuff. You guys will see um, later on that, you know, the fire, well, honestly, Joel was going to Jack Joseph's high school, the district high school, <coughs> and he uh, calls me on the way there and says, hey, Carla, there's a big, there's a fire going on, and he tells where it was at. And um, so I go over there, me and Nikki, and I was filming. So you guys will see the video about that, about what happened. It was just, you guys will hear in the video that I was getting sick to my stomach, just watching it, because it's scary, for one, because look what we live in. These things 
burn up like that. This woman's whole house was gone. Oh my God, it was just, it was like three houses in the row. The middle house was the main one that caught fire and it ended up to the next house next door. And then it singed the house, like just melted the, the um, siding, that's about it. it, didn't go inside the house, just melted the siding. And it was just, oh, it was scary. You guys will hear the story is how in, in the video that people were talking, you would hear more about it. If I find out more information in due time, you know, I could really honestly put it in the description below because this video is going to be way out. So when this, it happened on September 12th, so when the fire happened, this video is going to be out maybe towards like two weeks from now. She went home! Yeah. Two weeks from now. That's where you guys will see this. So you guys will see some stuff in the description if I can remember to do it. But um, it, it was just, it was terrifying. It was scary. I'm tired of using these damn, uh, come on. I'm using the paper towels. So I'm cleaning it off this way. But it was just a scary sight. You know, I got a lot of footage. Uh, we saw our, our police officer friend over there too. We didn't talk to him, which we probably will find out more with him later. Um, we, have, we actually have a county police officer that Joel grew up with, lived next door, went to high school with everything. So they know each other. And we kind of get some of our information around here. You know, And stuff like that. All right, this area is done, but I can't really clean anything. Joseph's just gotta take this out. Oh, I'm dizzy. <coughs> Does anybody have problems with dizziness? Dizziness when they're cleaning or doing anything around the house or anything like that. I mean, do you guys ever have that problem? And no, it's not this, because I have it regularly without drinking Monster or Pop or water or whatever. You know, I think the only time I never had dizziness when I was sick, which honestly I'm doing better. And I kind of had maybe today was two cigarettes. I need to stop, so I'm gonna try not to smoke any the rest of the day. Because you know I do love my cigarettes, and that's just something I have. You know, I was gonna try, I'm trying to quit. I really am, which I should. You know, there's days I went out with no smoking at all. But that's just how my body is. When I'm sick, I don't smoke. I don't crave it. But yesterday and day before, I was like, damn, I want one. I smell it. I smell it in the house. I smell it on our, our fabrics. It's like, God, I love the smell. I do. I like this. Oh, cigarettes. Sounds kind of crazy, but I do. Um, I'm going to wipe that off with Lysol. The stove I'm not doing today. The stove needs to be done. I will do that probably last because it's a pain in the ass to me, for me to clean. I hate it. The grates, I hate cleaning. You know, I, I just don't like it. You know, maybe um, when it cools off, I will actually do like the whole entire stove, like the stove cleaning. Because I have a cleaning thing on my stove. You know, I do. So maybe I'll do all that and I can stick the grates in the inside and do the top. I love this thing. I don't know if you guys were, if I was recording when uh, I was telling Nikki, uh, this is a cutting board, but my luck, I'll cut on it and it will, I will slip and cut myself. But this is a, sh this is a marble cutting board. It's beautiful. I love it. So it comes into the purpose of just holding like, you know, stuff higher up, like the toothpaste thing and everything. I need to find another toothpaste holder that's easier. Wish I can get the ones that just tacks on the wall. Everybody just sticks a toothbrush in there. You know? Alright. So let me put this guy back over there since it's clean. I need to work out with this sucker. Mm. Oh, it's still wet. Oh, Who that rag go?
Okay, this stuff I wash, but I'm gonna stick these little things on it. Oh, shit. So I'm just gonna stick this right here for now. Okay, take these, this guy off. I can fill this up with more oil. This ain't wet or nothing, so I'm gonna put it on the table. See, look at the difference. How dirty this one is, and this one. You know, but I keep this for the reason why I keep this is for like, just like I scrub the table just to get the dirt off and shit. Then I'll put it in the sink, rinse it out, and stuff. I could probably throw this in the washing machine. <coughs> then what I do is I wipe it off like soap and water like you guys seen and put down, I can't explain this one's full of four, but there's new people here. I would put down, um, clean it off and then I'll let it dry and then I'll put down like white salt or something to, to sanitize it and clean it up that way. That's what I basically do. All right, these guys have These are my other glasses. Put them over here. I don't wear them because I don't like them. They're too dark. And I can't replace them because I've already asked them to like, do it. Alright, let's pull up. Take off I Love Lucy. Now, I was thinking since these videos would probably end up in. Um, in the, uh, I'm going to put the knife here. Freaking Joel is going shit away. Oh, damn, look at this. I got money. Stick that in my purse. Um, what's it called? I can't think of what I was going to say. Oh, for Halloween. We are having a Halloween party. We haven't had one in years. And... The reason why I would have one this time, oh, this is gonna go over here. Um, this time we're having, because we haven't had one in years. I think the last time we had one was, um, we had a personal problem with the family. So, but it, we're all, they're all good now. Between the twins, they're like that, between the twins. But, um, so we stopped with the, actually, matter of fact, the last time we actually had a Halloween party, Joel was drinking. So it's been about almost two years where we haven't had one. So, yeah, we're gonna have one this year. So, and the rule is everybody has to dress up. You don't have to go and buy a costume, come up with something, you know, make your own, but I'm gonna buy a costume because I haven't bought one in years for me. The boys are gonna dress up and everything else. Joel's gonna dress up. He might dress up to the thing, oh, he always dresses up. I don't know why he won't buy a new costume, which he should. And I'm gonna get I'm like everybody I know. This one, I have a big one. Um, so my idea is, I was thinking about being a French maid, or like put myself to put a cook uniform on. I did have the cook hat, but I got rid of it. But um, make myself an actual cook. But it's gonna be, have to be slutty for me. Uh oh, Joseph's home. What?